Hi there, folks. This is Luke Charles Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, or Class B and B Plus RV Specialists. My friends call me Luke and my sisters call me Charlie, but you can call me anytime at 419 899 2020. Please check out our website at truckandrv.com. That's truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. There's a direct link to this particular RV in the video description below. If you follow that link, it will take you to our website where you can see the pricing and information on this unit. Once this unit is sold, that link will be removed. We are a full service dealer offering warranty as well as financing packages. If you have any questions, please give me or my brother Levi a call at 419-899-2020. For sale today, we have a 2008 Pleasureway Lexor RL4. Levi and I's mom, Kathy, and my mother-in-law, Becky, flew to California to pick up this beautiful pleasure way and had an unforgettable time on their trip home exploring the beauty of the American West. We suspect they'll be having more RV adventures together, but in honor of their first big trip together and to commemorate this beautiful camper van, we've decided to name this one the Golden Girl. They even made it to a certain famous corner in Winslow, Arizona. All right, folks, here we are inside of this 2008 Pleasure Way Lexor RL4. RL4 standing for Rear Living 4, as this unit is most optimal for four travelers. As usual, we're going to start in the front, work our way towards the rear, try to give you a good idea of the overall floor plan as well as the overall condition of this unit. Here at Coon Truck and RV, we are a family-owned and operated dealership since 1976, started by my dad, Ron. My brother Levi and I are in charge of the office, and my brother-in-law, Greg, is in charge of our shop. We are a full-service RV dealer. All of our coaches go through our full inspection and cleanup process before they hit the lot. That includes sterilization. Um, we fumigate them with Sterifab per state requirements, um, and also just something that we want to do regardless of whether we're re required or not. So we want you to have a clean RV and something that's ready to go the day you get it from us and something that you're going to be happy with for a long time afterward. With uh, the weather starting to warm up and things starting to open back up, we are getting pretty busy. So please call us ahead of time before you just come on out to look at something, make sure it's still here, but everything's always open. You can always check them out on your own or with us there to help you out. All right, let's get started checking out some of the goodies on this one. We've got uh, surround sound throughout. That's going to turn on and off the speakers for the surround sound. Got your levels test here. So you're going to test the uh, levels for your gray, your black, your onboard freshwater tank, as well as your coach battery. Also got the on off switch for your 12 volt water pump. That's going to pump the water out of that onboard freshwater tank. Got your 2800 Onan generator. It's got a fresh service by our certified Onan techs. Got 14 hours on that. Got the switch for your propane water heater. Got a uh, noxious gas detector there. So that's gonna start chirping at you there if you get some uh, nasties in the coach here that you shouldn't. And we've got some light switches, including this one here that's got a dimmer for some of the overhead bulbs. Flipping around to the driver's side. Got a nice microwave on this one. This window does open up here on the lower screened portion, so you can get some good airflow in here, as well as having this uh, little Insta hanger, or instant hanger that pops out here to hang some clothes. Flipping back around now to the passenger side. We've got a nice kitchen area on this one. Corian countertops. Got a um, compartment here below as well as the battery disconnect down in this compartment there and that red switch and your uh, fuse panel here behind this. Also got a stainless sink there and a two burner propane cooktop. Also got some nice storage overhead here. Quick look at your three-way Dometic fridge freezer. Here we are opposite the kitchen on the driver's side inside of the bathroom closet. There is the shower pan that's going to lay on the floor to catch the water and your toilet. Also got some space here that you can uh, store some goodies. The bathroom also does have these privacy sliders on the uh, front and the rear, so these doors will just slide 
to give you some privacy if you're using the restroom. Um, they lock into that little uh, doohickey on the cabinet there. And there's same same style here on the reverse. So you can uh, use this to give you privacy while you're using the restroom and also to uh, create some private sleeping areas. So uh, somebody can sleep up front. You could also have somebody sleeping in the back and give you each a little, little bit of privacy. Moving on now to the rear of the coach. We've got your overhead AC that runs off of your shore power or your onboard generator. It's controlled by the thermostat right here. This thermostat also controls your onboard propane furnace. Got a light switch for under the kitchen here. This TV does swivel out like this and come around. The front four chairs all swivel in this one so you could watch the TV from the front or you can watch it in the rear here while you are uh, enjoying in the U-shaped dinette. You also have your uh, DVD player here. This is all factory, this Clarion system. It's also got audio video in if you'd like to run an Xbox or a PlayStation. Uh, it's gonna control your DVD for the TV there as well as your speakers. So you've got the surround sound speakers in the back there as well as some in the front. Um, really a nice unit having all those extra goodies here, not something you see on your average unit. Uh, this RL4 was more of the deluxe model, so this is definitely a step up as far as some of the plush seats. Um, just some of the extra goodies you have in here. It's a very, uh, very, very nice RV. Got the U-shaped dinette in the rear here. Um, you can put a table there inside of that little plug. Basically, this area is going to fill up using a board and the cushions and going to make one big bed here in the back. You've got windows that open on both sides so you can get a good cross breeze going and um, get a good exhaust fan from the fantastic fan overhead. Really nice livable uh, back area on this one. Here we are sitting in the U-shaped dinette in the rear of the RV. What do you call a camping convict? A criminal intent. This is a really beautiful RV, a very unique floor plan that we don't see a whole lot of these RL4s. Uh, very nice if you do have four people you're looking to travel with. Um, that way you all four can sit up front and you can still have some room in the back if you were looking to take somebody else, but really designed for four folks to uh, be able to ride along in comfort and be able to stay in this camper van and sleep comfortably. We've got a 110 outlet down here, as well as the ducts for your furnace. Got a little uh, countertop flip out there that's going to add a little counter space for you, in case you get cooped up while you're cooking or making something. Give you a little demo of how this TV works. So the TV is going to go like that. So if you'd like to watch it while you're up front, you could do that. And you can also kind of place it how you'd like here in the rear. Got some good overhead storage above your kitchen there. Another 110 there below the counter. Don't think I mentioned that yet. And we've also got these TVs in both headrests. So those are factory as part of that Clarion system. Those DVDs are, that, those TVs will be controlled via the DVD player up there over the driver's um, center console there. We've also got some small tables behind this chair that can go inside of the uh, table mount there. So that way you could swivel all these chairs up front. All four of these do swivel and turn so you can face these how you like, uh, play a game up front, eat dinner, that kind of thing. Um, it's really unique to have those four front chairs swivel as well as to be able to make those beds um, that are as nice as these um, road track. And there's some other ones that have little front beds like this, but we'll check those out here in a second. You'll see that these ones are kind of unique those front two beds so these are the passenger and driver seats swiveled and then the two seats behind them you're going to pick up right on the front and they're going to jackknife out like so so it's going to flatten them out and then to put them back you just grab on the front side here lift it up and it's going to jackknife them back into regular chairs this is a nice easy setup that does create um, actually pretty effective and usable beds up front here so something that you can uh, quickly have it set up to uh, for bedtime up here Quick look at the cockpit area. We've got power windows, power locks, power mirrors. While we can never say for sure, this RV does appear to be a non-smoker. doesn't have any smells, burns, and the cigarette lighter is unused. This 2008 Pleasureway Lexor RL4 is a very beautiful specimen, very deserving of the nickname the Golden Girl. It's passed our full inspection, cleanup, and sterilization process, and it's ready to hit the road. And it's also met the approval of Levi and I's mom, Kathy, and my mother-in-law, Becky. They had a great time traveling home from California in this unit. Really had a blast, and I think it's something they'll be wanting to, go, to do again whenever there's an opportunity for them to go pick up an RV for us. 
I'm going to call this RV a 9.5 out of 10. There is really no perfect RV out there, and this one is about as close as you're going to get. Barely any blemishes, a couple maybe marks on the outside, but still very nice paint, very nice and clean inside throughout. Wonderful floor plan. Please like and share this video. Subscribe to our channel. Let us know what you like, what you want to see more of. We're here to help. We're here to answer any questions. If you need anything, please reach out to Levi or I, and we would be happy to do that to uh, get you more pictures, video, measurements. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976. All right, folks, we're going to go around the outside of this 2008 Pleasure Way Lexor RL4. This RV measures 20 feet bumper to bumper with an 11-foot Fiamma awning. It has four brand new tires. This RV is built on a Chevy 3500 chassis with a 6-liter Vortec V8. This is a great van to travel anywhere safely and get around the country, camp, do anything you'd like. We've got your coach battery in this compartment. The back of your refrigerator. Got a couple 110 outlets here in case you'd like to set up a table beneath the awning, watch TV, do some cooking. Got your furnace exhaust. The small clevis next to that is for the awning rod support. Coming around to the back of the RV. Got your propane tank down here. So that's going to be your onboard propane tank that's going to fuel your furnace, your fridge, your propane cooktop. Full size spare. We've got the back of your water heater. In here, we've got a sewer hose storage. We've got your city water and your cable TV hookups as they are labeled there. And we've also got the connection for your shore power. That's a 30 amp service. All right, we've got your sewer flushes here. So your black and your gray. I'm gonna flush the black first and then the gray. Another storage compartment with another sewer hose. Shore power cord, fresh water hose. And we've got the gravity fill for your fresh water tank. Mm -hmm.